Not sure what happened there. <laughs> and hopefully this is working the way it's supposed to be working. Uh, hi. Oh, and thank you for the follow, Holden. 32, 32, 32, 32. <laughs> uh, so yeah, today we're doing Cooking Simulator, hopefully. Uh, the screen looks a little frozen. It's probably not the best. There we go. Also not sure why Twitch chat is not updating for me here. Give me one second. Yeah, Twitch, I had a separate browser window open for Twitch chat and it's just not updating. But, uh, Give me like just a second, I apologize. Doing this in VR is not the easiest thing. Okay, there we go. Now I can see chat. No. Well, hopefully the audio is coming through okay and the frame rate's not terrible and... Oh God. Uh, there, no, that won't DNC any, maybe. <laughs> yeah, Cooking Simulator VR. Uh, I was in the beta test for this. It came out yesterday, more or less. Uh, 
and I wanted to try it out because it's a lot of fun. Uh, I am sitting in my chair using uh, my Oculus Quest. Uh, I'm trying not to bump into the microphone, which is about here for reference. Uh, <laughs> I've got a uh, control set up so I can kind of grab the world and move myself around it. So, like, you know, if I ever have to reach above the ducks or something, or somewhere impossibly low, I can do that. Because, you know, I'm chair bound and I can't move like that. Um, so, yeah. Actually, this is just distracting. I just realized I hit my mute button, so uh, a lot of that probably wasn't transmitted, was it? <laughs> uh, it's been a day. I punched my mute button. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> See, like I was saying... The game is out of beta, it released yesterday. I uh, picked it up. We're gonna do career mode. It's a bit different than the 2D version as there's not gonna be pop-ups in my face. She's just gonna appear on these monitors. Uh, and I can move myself around the world by grabbing and pulling the world. That's just something I have set up in Steam VR for mobility aid. And Hopefully everything is still running and hasn't exploded because I have a monitor attached to my face and I can't see OBS. Anyway, let's do the tutorial. Uh, I'm the manager of this place. Since it's your first day, I'll show you the ropes. Before we start, three important things you need to know because you get lost. During this tutorial, you can take view your task in the bottom left corner of the room screen. Yeah, I guess she means this. Two, you can minimize the task list. And auto save between stages. This place empty, we're gonna do something about it. First, we need some utensils. Find the tablet and grab it to buy a blender. And suddenly, I have a blender. And she wants me to just basically buy one of everything. Bake tray. Big, big pots. Cutting board. Can. Get out of my hand. A spatula. A spatula. Oh god. And a knife. No. Oh shit. There we go. Forgot the uh, pull action. 
Will it let me? I just punched my microphone again. Hey, my microphone doesn't need to be that close. Who knows? <laughs> uh, what do you want now? Good job. I did it. But the organization here is terrible. I demand an orderly workspace. Fuck you, radio. Huh. Ah. Well, that's dangerous looking. Actually, hold up. <clears throat> there. Oh, look. Use a computer on your computer. Yes, I use a left handed mouse. Buy all the free recipes. Got them. Okay, let's see. Utensils, recipes. Ah, yes, we need spices. Let's visit the shop. You know, I thought they had... Oh, they do. Okay. Come on. Let me hook. hook. Okay. So, she wants spices. Salt. I got salt for you. And... Pepper, or black pepper, cayenne pepper, dried dill, horseradish. No, my horseradish or my dill. And my thyme. Nice. We still need some liquids. Go to the shop and buy chicken broth, sour cream, and sunflower oil. Sunflower oil is, I guess, technically a liquid. Not quite blade and sorcery. Yeah. Yeah. We're almost there. Okay, I did my part. Let's see how well you do. I want you to serve me a baked trout. At the end, they'll rate you as a regular guest would. Right. We need a trout. Let's... I can't do a Gordon Ramsay. Let's find a refrigerator, shall we? Stop playing on your fucking iPad. Now. Here we have... Fresh-caught trout. Gorgeous. Where everyone and their mother's doing Gordon Ramsay impersonations. Recipe calls for black pepper, dill, and thyme, five grams each. That baking tray. Dill. <gasps> no. I was gonna be a little dill heavy. Deal with it, Gordon. It's fucking raw. And time. Time, 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 time.
Now take the trout, place it on a baking tray. Look at the detail. You can even see where it was scored a bit. Not by me, though. Now let's place it on the oven, or in the oven, for s Follow the arrows. Gordon, how long do I put it in there? It's topped up, turn the oven on. Leave it in for 90 seconds. So, Chad, how's, how's your weekend been going? Oh no, the timer stopped. Oh no. No, 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 no. Best guess. Oh shit. How's that looking? Yeah, it's just a little. It's a little blackened, maybe. Yeah. Be a little underdone. Who knows? Uh, click. We need a lemon. Buy one. Buy one. It's right here. Leave my refrigerator open. Place it on the cutting board. Now you get to see my non-existent knife skills. Get this out of here. Now, cut the lemon into four even pieces to get down to its level. Chop. 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 I did. I cut the lemon into four pieces. I did. Oh, the truck's not finished baking. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. No! Oh, good save. Get back in there. Uh, 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 uh. Lemons there. 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 Lemon, 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 lemon. Horseradish. I love me some horseradish, but I'm not sure it goes on trout. How much? 
5G. Heavily seasoned plate. It's a garnish. Yep. <clears throat> Fresh parsley. Why am I picking up the plate and then getting... Alright. I make you fucking balance. Is that enough parsley for you, Gordon? Six grams. Yeah. Good, the dish is done. Now you need to serve it. Then I press this, press that, and it gets whisked away. Well, uh, five stars all the way down. The guest is pleased. Temperature perfect, and too much dried dill. The ambience is, um, off-putting, to say the least. We're done for today. After each day, I'll present to these for the dead After each day, I'll be presented with a summary of progress the restaurant made. And please don't go bankrupt. New perks available. Uh, uh, you know what? I'm going to go with thermal vision. No, I'm not. I mean, I want to, but chat, what should I do? I wish my work day took 20 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> uh. I'll go with steady hands. Sure. Okay, so I got three skill points. I can now... Ooh. That's a lot. Guests pay 10, 30, 50% more for their orders without affecting the score. Kitchen decorations are cheaper, more experienced, chain stars, rain points, liquids. I think the money one is probably the way to go. Then... Lower the cost of product and will lower the cost or will increase the size of the tips. I didn't expect this to be a full damn RPG, you know?
All right. Blah, 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 blah. Skill perks. Hi, are you excited as I remember? Everything you serve today will affect our reputation. Let's do this. Let's, uh, let's clean up a little first. Organization is kind of important, right? Don't mind that I just, you know, left the refrigerator open all night long. Close. Uh, that's clean. So good. Knife away. Throw some time on the counter for luck. I think this was made by the House Flipper people, if I remember correctly. So I'm kind of surprised they didn't do, like... I mean, I know they did a food network. But it would have been neat if they actually did get some sort of tie-in with Gordon Ramsay. Since they obviously parody him in the start. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, use the skill app manager on the left side. Yeah, we we did that. We we did that. First order for today is salmon steak with boiled potatoes. Find the big pot. We'll need to boil the potatoes. Yes, chef. Fill it with about one liter of cold tap water. Now add 20 grams of salt. Gordon does love his salt. It's too much, but you know what? Buy two potatoes while holding the pot. Look at that liquid physics. Kind of. Place the pot on the cooker and boil for about 120 seconds. Two minutes go. Excuse me. By the way, when I'm staring at my wrist here, I'm chat is like right here. So that's just me looking at you guys. Hi guys. <laughs>
I would... I've never... I mean, I've boiled potatoes. I've never seen the water turn, like, the color of potato. I've seen it get cloudy, sure, but it's never taken on this potato chip color. There's my microphone. I haven't nailed that potato water ticket. Yeah. Alright. I guess while we're waiting on that, we'll get a salmon steak ready. G five G. Little pepper. I don't have a plate. Do with the potato later they can sit. Don't worry about that. In sixty seconds. Oh yeah, it's uh it's a little overcooked. Don't worry about that. No, let's hope this is good enough. Oh boy. Uh, Ramsey, I did. I have each side. Oh. Not how you cook a salmon, but okay. In real life, you can leave a salmon skin side down. 
and you can see how well it's cooked by watching this part. You don't have to flip the whole thing. Twenty seconds. Go. Oh, not bad. Guess complaints. It was too salty and had not enough oil, and there's some heating mistakes. Not, not too bad, Alfred Wise. Fuck out of here. Tomato soup. Seven hundred billable. I did. Gordon, I, I, I did what you wanted. There's 700 mil in here. Now season according to the recipe, it's salt. That's not the salt. Jedi, Jedi Hill's Kitchen. Probably we'll actually need this, so. Whatever. Okay, and, and cayenne pepper. No. Oh well. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah, oh, this is all wrong. It's all wrong. Onion. Yep. <laughs> I don't know what I did to this recipe. <laughs> Hold up, you know what? Fuck this. We're gonna we're gonna start this over.
Come on, come on, come on, come on. We have 1.1 liters of chicken profit, we fine. Uh. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. What do I do? Oh, <laughs> Wait, did it go through? Okay, it's not in. <laughs> 150. I added 120. Oh, what a mess. Alright, now what? Take a deep plate, also known as a bowl. Master Chef. Baked trout. <sighs> I think you can do this one on your own. <laughs> Bullshit. Alright, whatever. Black pepper.
seconds. up this up it's something still sizzling here we'll never know and there's a lemon coming up you have to do this Three, two, one. Damn. Right in their hands. Then we just pick it up gently, move it across the kitchen, and parsley, parsley, parsley. Almost perfect. 34 out of 30 fame points. We're 530 in the hole, by the way. Uh, increase the duration of the preparation phase and the serve time and increase the time it takes to burn something. Um, I think we should expand the menu. Should it be pork chops with baked potatoes? Or should it be simple Ukrainian borscht? Chat, you decide. Ukrainian borscht? Or pork chops and baked potatoes? I said, what the fuck dungeon am I in? <laughs> you know, this is like the room that like Randy shoves the teens in. He needs to yell at them on Hell's Kitchen. <coughs> there was the borscht, uh, which is chicken broth, salt, pepper, beetroot, onion, carrot, and parsley. Yeah, okay. But um, sadly, I realize this is going to this is going to make this an incredibly short stream. Uh, I had to call it here because uh, we got to take care of some stuff. 
uh, nothing, nothing major. Just got to take care of some maintenance and some other things around the house. But I wanted to uh, at least uh, show this off a bit. Uh, definitely we'll be doing more of this in the future. Uh, hopefully not uh, in such a rush state. And hopefully with some of the team around to help commentate. Because, man, I'm really not good at this whole solo gig. Uh, one second to switch to desktop view so I can see what the heck I'm doing. Also, uh, there's a couple of our friends who are streaming right now. We're definitely going to give one a raid. Uh, the... There we go. I can see. Oh, daylight. It's weird. And as always, I want to thank you for spending, well, I guess, your afternoon with us. Uh, we'll be back on Monday. Uh, not sure what we're doing yet, uh, but keep an eye on the Twitter at Team Retrofox there if you're not already following us uh, to keep track of what we're doing and when we're doing it. Uh, special thanks to our subscribers scrolling on thanks <laughs> to our subscribers scrolling on screen now. We couldn't do what we do without your support. You're all very much loved and appreciated. Uh, if you're not already following us here on Twitch, please do so. It definitely helps us out. Uh, if you want to support the channel and you have Prime Gaming, or Amazon Prime, you have a Prime Gaming subscription that you can give out to a streamer of your choice. Helps us out as much as a paid subscription. Uh, we'd be honored if you choose us for that. If you don't want to do it through Amazon, there's a Patreon link down below. Also linked down below is our YouTube where you can catch all of our past playthroughs of all the different games we've done uh, up till now. Uh, we do like to end things with a raid to help out our friends, and let's pop in on Girl Stream Team. They are currently playing Operation Tango, Double O Girls in Operation Tango. Not sure what that is, but uh, we'll pop in and say hi to them. And again, we'll see you Monday. Thanks for stopping in. Stay safe out there. Bye-bye.